We started off in small serviced offices in Melton, which were great for a, for a period of time. They were very flexible. It allowed us to, to grow and get extra space as we took more people on. Fairly quickly, we were up to sort of 10, 15 people, but we realized that we wanted to get our own premises really, somewhere that we could put our own stamp on, somewhere that we could develop and, and sort of grow into. So early 2014, we started looking for, for our own free old premises. And eventually, after a lot of hard work, we found the premises that we're at now, down Albion Street in Hull City Centre. We had a vision of providing products and services that other accountants weren't. We wanted to be different, we wanted to differentiate ourselves from, from the competition. What we're trying to achieve is, is a, a true 360 approach to the way we service our clients. So we basically build up a really good relationship with our clients so that whenever they do ring up with, a, with an issue, we know them, we know the business and, and we're able to give them a solution. We were planning on maybe within three or four years needing to look at alternative offices, bigger offices, etc. Just through a pure sort of twist of fate, I was having a coffee with the owner of the building next door and he said he was sort of starting to think about retirement and what to do with the building. After a bit of sort of discussion and negotiation, we made an offer for the building which, which they accepted. So there's, there's been several stages within our business growth as there is with any business where we've had to look at you know what, what funding have we got in place what extra funding do we need where do we go for that funding that's when we've sort of turned to, to Darren you know, we're, we're all really busy you know, we, we haven't really got time to sort of scour the market look at what the offer is work out which is the, the most beneficial etc we want to be looking after our clients affairs not our own so whenever we've needed help in respect of the funding we get Darren in, he knows our business, he knows us, so he's able to put proposals together really quickly, send them to the right people. If he comes back to us with you know, option A or option B, we know that there's no need to go and find out whether there's an option C. Whenever we've needed help from a funding point of view, we've just tapped into Darren. It's basically an extension of our business. And I guess over the years, as the trust and the relationship has, has increased, we've just started using using each other on a, on a more frequent basis.